All right, next we're gonna talk about design. And I put fundamental because this is my favorite part, really. You wanna follow certain rules that are found in nature. If you go and study a topic called the golden mean, it's, it's this concept of everything follows patterns. From the universe to flowers, plants, animals, storms. Have you ever noticed how that, that kind of follows a certain pattern? Well, that's found in architecture if it's done the right way. Now, there's plenty of bad designs out there. And they don't take the time to learn the science behind the beauty that you can have in your house. So there's certain ratios. So if you follow these ratios, you've probably seen them in art. Uh, with the Mona Lisa and with the Parthenon and with the Taj Mahal. I'm going to show you some pictures of those. Um, I also have a secret on uh, how Donald Trump won the election. Think about it. He followed the rule right there. Everybody was blown away by that. Um, but we see a lot of this. All these proportions are found in natures and plants. It's what attracts us to our spouse. It's about your nose proportion to your, your ears and eyes. I got people winking at me now, right? But it is. You think about ear proportion, nose, mouth, eyes, and that's what attracts us to certain people. It's, it's, in, it's in nature, like I said. Um, here is some of the other architecture. You can see how they follow these rules. Um, so when we design plans, we follow these rules so that they naturally look right and comfortable. And you may not understand the science behind it, but when you walk in a plan that's following these rules, it feels right, okay? Uh, I still actually start out designing plans while on graph paper, because it helps me follow those rules and proportions. We also follow rules, which I'll touch on in a little bit, about just the size of materials. I mean, we know that plywood comes in four by eight, drywalls in four by eight or four by 10, carpet comes in 12 foot rolls. If we start designing our homes to follow the sizes of materials, we're naturally gonna save money. All right, you're gonna have less in the dumpster and you're gonna start using your materials better.